Rex, my little corner of YouTube. So, what are we doing today? It's the first reaction. A song I do know, an artist I've never heard of in my life, and it's Angelina Jordan. Now, why am I here? I had a very nice conversation with an international friend of the channel who said, Alan, um, you know, I've been listening to you for a while, and please could you do this? I'd be pleased if you could listen to this artist, what you think of her exactly. I'm not a critic, I'm just a music fan. I said, okay, who is she? She says, it's Angelina Jordan. She's Norwegian. The first video I'm going to send you is when she was 13. This is singing in her sitting room or something like that. So I went and looked her up. I don't know if she uses a stage name Angelina Jordan, but her name is Angelina Jordan Astar. She's Norwegian. She's got a lovely mixed background. I think she's got Japanese grandparents, uh, Swedish mom or a Swedish Iranian mom. I'm not sure. It's all there. So anyway, that's just because I read it. But this is an Etta James song, which I've heard Beth Hart do. So there's no guarantee I'm going to like this. Genuinely, there isn't. Because it's blind. I don't, I don't know how she's going to sing it or what she's going to do. I do know the song, and we'll get into it. It's not very long. Sorry about the long introduction, but I, again, I was asked to just do this. So I will. You guys ask me to do things, and sometimes I'll do them. Thirty, stop it now, stop it. And she looks a little bit like Fauzia. Um, so, what are we going to get? Well, this is an Etta James song from 1967, not written by Etta James. Actually, it wasn't a single by Etta James at all. It was a B-side to a single that was released called Tell Mama. Um, although, obviously, everyone knows Etta James. But I've listened to Beth Hart sing it, which is beautiful. So... I'm going to pull it back because it's just like she waves as if to say hi. I don't know if that's a mom. I don't know. What's the context behind the video, guys? Is this some sort of just family YouTube channel? Had she already been singing by then? Did, we all, did you guys already know who she was? She's going to be 18 now, I know. Let's get back. subtle differences and I think people could be sort of hyperbolic and say you know is she an old soul returning no she's just she's got a good voice she's doing what a 13 year old would do she's hearing a song she's singing a song and you can hear there's some of the adult edges she's not going to reach yet but it's stunningly beautiful she's got beautiful voice I mean a beautiful voice to be able to do that is vocal talent anyway, but just the actual range of her voice. It's beautiful. And I know I've got another song 
um, is this a cover? Is this a homage? Is this a 13-year-old saying Etta James is... Because a 13-year-old loving Etta James is, is like me liking Taylor Swift. Makes no sense. Do you know what I mean? But it's there. It's beautiful. I don't know if it's a scripted performance and she's done it 20 times. But I really like it. Really like it. Boris's channel. Let's stop it because I've gone back. Sound enhanced 4K UK UHD video. There looked like there was a bit of jiggery pokery going on with the post production, but I don't know if that's just the sound. But what a what a beautiful voice. Forget the air James. I'm intrigued as to where she gets that from because there's still depth and resonance there. You can fake it till you make it, but you can't fake it completely. She still had to be in tune with the song. She still had to have an understanding of what she was trying to sing about. Maybe not experiencing the pain of breakups. God, I hope not at 13. But it's still got to be part of her makeup. She's still got to have that ability to draw in on a feeling. Otherwise, it's just straight parrot. And I didn't hear that. I heard different in, different inflections in her voice. And they weren't in line always with how Eta James was singing it. Or even how the original was sung. Just not completely. I'm familiar with the song. Loved it. Looking forward to my next one from this young lady. I don't know anything about her. I really don't. And the, the, the conversation I had with the gentleman was, well, she's moved to LA. She's got a background in singing. She's doing some independent stuff. She's got a channel. But this first one, when she was 13, she's only 18 now. That's my first look at her. Obviously, like I said, I've Googled who she is. Just so I had some sense. So I wasn't like an idiot going in super blind. But I didn't know this. I hadn't heard her sing. Lovely. Thank you very much, my international friend. And thank you very much, channel. I hope you enjoy it. It's just pleasant. It's sweet. It's nice. It's a surprise. And I'm intrigued. Can't ask so much more. Till next time, guys. Take care.